How's it going everybody? So today's video is going to be a little bit shorter, but I'd like to bring up a point that somebody made in one of my more watched videos about Stronghold Kingdoms, that being the uh, many attacks on one village, I think it was like 17 timed attacks. So somebody noticed that the oil pots replenish uh, like in between attacks. And I explained it to them in the comments, but not everybody might see the comments. So I thought it would be useful to explain the phenomenon behind this in a video of itself. So what I have here is the report. This is the final rendition of the video. I didn't have an opportunity to go and collect a new report to show this on. So I'm just going, you know, for brevity, I'm going to show what's going on here. So we have the attack set up already. The catapults have uh, taken down the first two rows of towers, and now they're actually removing the walls. Now, on top of the walls, you'll see there are oil pots. Now, once the oil pots get hit by the catapults stones, they are removed from those walls. But if the attack does not go through if this attack is not successful and the village is not raised and then you attack the village again on the next the next attack every single one of those oil pots that was removed by the catapults firing at them will be returned to that exact same square even as you can see right here by this the in between these two archers who got knocked off the towers even if it's just sitting on the ground it can be restored on the ground and this is exactly how you end up in situations where in between attacks it will appear that somebody restored the oil pots and potentially restored them on top of either a building wall or no wall at all. It's really not as complicated. So let's just continue playing all the way through here. As you can see, uh, the attack is pretty much over with. That attack's over with. And now we're going to launch the next attack. Just what I want to pause it. it. There we go. All the oil pots are back. Uh, you saw those oil pots that were destroyed before, they're back now. And that is exactly the reason why. So how to get rid of oil pots then? Well, you gotta send in troops and trip them. That is the really, that's really the only way to ensure that the oil pots are out of the way. Just simply destroying them with the catapults will only work for that attack. So in other words, if I had my troops here, let's say I put the archers in front of the pikemen to sort of hold them in place, while the catapults fired on this area around the keep where the oil pots are, the oil pots would be removed for this attack, and my pikemen would be able to go through there unhindered by the oil pots. But if I go ahead and do another attack, the oil pots will be back as evidenced in this report right here. They will be back in front of the keep because they were only destroyed by catapult fire and not by actually tripping. Now, I'm not sure whether or not this is a bug, but it is a little bit interesting because it, it, it does appear to the casual observer that this is caused by somebody restoring the oil pots in between attacks and I could understand why that would why you would reach that conclusion but I think it is important to note that is not the case this is just one of those little tips that I think can really help you help better understand how attacking and defending in stronghold kingdoms works so anyway I hope that fully explain that concept. If you have any additional questions on how this works, feel free to ask them in the comment section below. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching as always, and I hope to see you next time.